I'm in love with you, Daddy. Ooh, you. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Classic Who reaction. We're on to The Mask of Mandragora. Yes. Part four. Oh, I've got a stitchy eye. It is the 1st of November. Um, lockdown has just been announced for a second time. Um, I'm okay with it. It doesn't affect me. I work in the NHS. I carry on as normal. Um, it affects me, obviously, with uh, seeing family members. So, but in the grand scheme of things, I'm so sorry, I've got like a hair on me. Um, in the grand scheme of things, I am one of the lucky ones. I have friends who have small businesses and I have just started up my own small business, but it won't be impacted by the lockdown. I just want you guys to know that you will get through it. I know some of you really struggled with the last lockdown and um, I don't want to be preachy, but I just want you to know that there will be a light at the end of the tunnel and, and, and you, you will get through it. it it's probably going to feel a bit shit for a while, but um, we've been through a lockdown before and my suggestion would be maybe try and find something that you can focus on, whether it be you've wanted to learn a new instrument or you can dive even more into your studies or you want to start a YouTube channel. I would just try and find something that you can focus your energy on. Um, I mean, that's easier said than done, but if, if I could just help, if I could just give any bit of advice, that would be um, what I would suggest. And also just speak to someone. If you're feeling a certain way, please speak to someone. It is so important because you're not alone in how you're feeling. And um, like I always say, my DMs are open. I, I can't always have full blown conversations with you guys that carry on over weeks because I don't have the, the, the time and the day to do that. But if you want to drop me a message, I always reply. Um, so yes, just, I hope you're all okay. Um, the other bit of news is that I have dropped the trailer for Doctor Who December. I was going to wait to drop the trailer, but you know, why not? I have been so excited to show you guys this trailer. A wonderful, wonderful subscriber friend of mine, Kevin, did it. So thank you so much. I, I'm not going to lie, I, I almost shed a tear the first time I saw it because I'm just so... I don't know I'm just really happy to be here and if I can put a smile on your face throughout Doctor Who December then I've then I've done my job I have some very exciting plans some of which may not come into fruition because they're a little bit out there um but I'm just really excited if you have any videos that you want me to watch fan videos or anything just let me know and I'll add them to my list uh I don't think I'm going to tell you in advance what I'm reacting to I was considering releasing like a 31 day set list essentially but I don't know I think I'm just going to keep it a surprise for each day so yes, that's the other news. I hope you are excited. And if you're not, then... Anyway, I've been rambling for like six minutes. Let's go. Part four, I would assume this is the last part. I kind of hope this is the last part. Let's go. Blood into you, brothers. Tomorrow night, we shall witness the last prophecy. As it is written, Mandragora shall swallow the moon. Swallow the moon? I don't think that's possible. 
Oh, soldiers, are we to die without a priest? Or even a monthly breakfast? No priest available. Will a brother do? What have you done with the Count, sorcerer? Out. Hit my uncle? Yes, in the temple ruins. How did he die? Let's say Hieronymus gave him a blank look. <laughs> Oh, how the tables have turned. Take him to the block, sire. No, Marco. Take him away. His fate will be decided later. That's when they'll strike. I know, but what does it mean? Yes. Oh, it's going to be like an eclipse? Another 50 years, we could have used Galileo. Well, where are you going now? Dragora swallows the moon. In other words, a lunar eclipse. And that's when the brother. That's what I said. Yes. More important is when all this could become man's only science. Doctor, I must see. There is still an empty tray you know nothing of. Bring me ten of the brethren. I will take them to the place. Tonight, there is a mask in the Duke's honor. We will provide the entry tray. Oh, great. Not a coat. I don't know if this is going to be only four parts. But they lost. You know, the worse the situation, the worse your jokes get. Oh my god. This ball that they're having would be my worst nightmare. Crazy that that used to be the entertainment. I've had a report from the guards. Our walls are thick and solid, and our guards well trained. A match for any in the land. At least we have your uncle to thank for. Yeah, but they're probably already inside. The entertainers, right? Anonymous and his followers would have realized their mistake. You see the doctor. Oh, look how pretty she looks. It was gone into the evening when I told the guard. Boy is waiting, not knowing what's happening to him. It's worse than being with him. How would she know what, like, the dance to do? You profane the sacred stone. Had a hard day in the catacombs. You profane the sacred stone. Oh, come off it, Hieronymus. You know who I am. You can drop all that bosh about sacred stones and profanity. Just be your natural horrid self. Why have you come here? To be swept aside like the dirt that you are. Die. Doctor! 
Oh, he's got the thing on. It's not the doctor. What happened? Where have you been? Oh, stop playing the fool and tell me what happened. No, he won't, but the Earth will. The constellation will be in position to try again in about 500 years. 500 years, that takes us to just about the end of the 20th century. That's right. Now, that was an interesting century. What do you mean, it was? Come on. So, when that part started, I was thinking, oh, it's a little bit slow, and then I thought, maybe it's going to go on and be five parts um the second half of that episode i thoroughly enjoyed i liked the whole the ball um i wasn't expecting for some reason the doctor to be in the purple cloak thing um i mean it did kind of feel like it was finished very quickly like oh yeah the doctor solved it done if that makes sense um but i really enjoyed it as in that the second part of that episode overall mm, there were definitely bits that i liked but i probably would i probably would put that at a, at a s seven maybe a seven and a half uh yeah i really liked the sci-fi element but there were definitely some bits that i just found a little bit samey you know what? i just know what seven and a half i'm gonna go seven and a half yeah yeah well i feel like i've been on this story for so long what's this a bit of floof a bit of floof on my jumper uh yeah mainly because where the bbc have been blocking them it's been they haven't been going up quickly and i don't know why i just feel like it's taken me ages to get through that four parts that those those four parts next up we've got to be going into space that's what i reckon space maybe some unit please yeah, I reckon we're going into space. 
Right, thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. I will be back tomorrow with another reaction.